out to lunch now for my brother's birthday lunch. It's gonna be an early birthday lunch because his birthday is next week, but he's going back to college. So we're gonna celebrate it today. And we're going to this hot pot place that I went to with my Bible study group a few weeks ago, and it was super good. It's like a Chinese Sichuan hot pot place. And for the price and for everything that you can get, it's really good quality meats. You can get so many different veggies. There's a lot of different soup bases. So I will take you guys along with me. Right now I'm just doing my makeup. Just doing a light makeup look today because I think later on Jack and I are gonna go work out. I don't want to wear too much. So I'm just gonna do a light base with the e.l.f. liquid glow filter. Later today, we're gonna go to Sephora and I'm gonna grab a few new makeup products that I've been wanting to try. And it's a blush item because I'm running out of this blush. Like, look at this guys. It's on its last life. But I wanna try the Milk Makeup and the YSL Cheek Stains. I heard really good reviews on it. So I really wanna try that out. With any makeup look, I always love putting on blush. And that's probably my favorite part of any makeup look. And that's why I'm gonna invest in a good blush product. If you guys have seen me do my makeup, I put so much on. As you can tell, that's why there's barely any left. I really look forward to the weekends now, just because during the week, Everyone's at work and I'm just studying and I don't really get to do makeup. Whenever we hit the weekend, it is Saturday today. There's always fun events, you know, things going on, a reason to put on some makeup. So that is why we are doing our makeup today. And for my lip product, just gonna wear my everyday lip balm, Summer Fridays in, I believe, Vanilla. Let's pick out an outfit. Do a quick outfit check. Just wearing my favorite sweater from Urban. And then these green cargo pants, also from Urban actually. But that is the look. I think I'm gonna pair it with my favorite Trader Joe's bag. Of course, let's head over to the hot pot place and get some food. <laughs> to the gym and gonna hit a upper body workout. So we'll see you guys there.
for dinner, we're making Vietnamese-inspired chicken wings using a recipe by Tiffy Cooks. We have the chicken in the air fryer, and now we're making the sauce. Chuji here is just mincing the garlic, and we're using this new tool that... Oh my oh. gosh, that just... <laughs> okay, I, at least it didn't go in my eye. Not on camera. Yeah. I saw that fly out. Chicken is done. Okay, chef. Oh, it was salty? Uh, I hope it. It's okay. We made a second batch. Let's see if it's good. And we didn't even add sauce. We just put all the chicken back in the bowl. Right? <laughs> yeah, that's better. Yes. <laughs> Much better. <laughs> Gummy. This one's crunchier too, so. Yeah. Now we're making the Sweet Lorenz vegan dairy-free cookies. And I heard these are really good and life-changing. So let's put that to the test and try some cookies. Just a little almost midnight snack. They smell so good. Smell. Mm. Yum. Okay, let's try it. Mm. Oh, me first. Mmm. That's a perfect texture. These are good. How is it vegan? Dang. These are life changing. Mmm. <laughs> hey guys, it's the next day, and we just came back from church. I did my makeup as well using the new makeup products that I bought yesterday at Sephora. I didn't get a chance to show you guys, but I got some new products and I will do like a whole makeup routine tutorial in the future. But right now I'm on the way to Central Market with my family. We're gonna grab some food there, eat some lunch. For the rest of the day, I'm just gonna hang out with Chuji and we will probably go on a run, maybe around a three to four mile run later. But I am super hungry. It's around 1.30 now. It's time to get some food. So I'll see you guys at Central Market. kind of cold and I'm only wearing a sports bra and shorts but we're gonna go stretch now and let's get to running <laughs> Quick and easy dinner or half. It has been a few days since the last clip, but I wanted to show you guys what I got from Sephora. And I am so excited to show you guys what I got. I was too excited the other day that I didn't even show you what I purchased. But it's been a while since I've been to Sephora or Ulta or like any makeup store and got myself some makeup. So I decided to because I've heard such good things about these products. First product that I got Ilia Base Face Milk Moisturizer. And I'm actually gonna put it on right now. Look how gorgeous the packaging is. It's very moisturizing. And 
very dewy i feel like perfect for like a base layer before makeup okay so we will put that on to keep my face hydrated for the day the next thing i got is a few tower 28 products and i've never owned any tower 28 products before so these are my first ones i picked up a concealer and the shine on lip jelly and i got it in the shade cashew but then for the concealer i got it in the shade k-town and then i picked up the ysl chic tint this one's in the shade neutrals i'm just gonna put a little bit on my cheeks i'm loving the consistency of this product i also wore it yesterday stayed on pretty much the whole day that's a plus and it blends in super well so today super light just the ysl cheek tint and then some mascara because we're not really going anywhere just gonna go to world market to pick up a journal getting new makeup products that i get to try it just makes me so excited because i've been using some of the same products since the past like three years so it's definitely time for a change and i want to try more popular products and see how they work with my skin <music> Which is great that's what i came for but then i decided to get some clips for when i do my makeup so these are really cute it has like this marbling design on it with a ton of different colors then i got the journal i decided to get this one with this print on it it says it's okay to not do everything because i feel like this really speaks to me and resonates with me like right now this is perfect because i've been needing to get a new journal i've filled up my other journal that I've had for like six months, so it's time for a new one. 